Hey everybody, it's me, Sean, Nerd Dad Extraordinaire. I am currently filming in my kitchen, sitting on a uh, step stool, and hanging out with uh, the little miss over here. Say hi! Say hi! <laughs> so today I want to talk about another class. Um, it's D080, which is Managing in a Global Environment. Um, that's the next OA class in the series for me. I just got to say that I thought D073, the um, management principles class, I thought that was super dry and boring, um, but it had nothing on D080. I started the class and I read the first four lessons and I was just extremely unmotivated. Um, the material was just so boring and I just didn't care because I don't ever foresee myself being in a global type business. I'm more of a fan of being regional, uh, being local, taking care of the community where you're at, and stuff like that. So on a Thanksgiving day, after I had a really good Thanksgiving dinner with my family, um, I decided that I just needed to get the class out of the way. I didn't want the class just hanging over my head forever, and so I needed to do something about it. So I bought two rock stars. And that night I worked from, I think it was 9.30 p.m. Could you not? I'm, I'm doing a video. As I was saying, I on my way home from my parents' house, I bought two rock stars and I worked from 9.30 p.m. until about 6.30 a.m. the next day. Um, I took a four hour nap. I took the pre-assessment and then I took the OA and I passed the class with what looked to be about an 85%. The class has such a wide, um, like, such a wide set of things that it tries to teach you that it kind of feels like it brambles on and it doesn't really connect with itself in a lot of ways. And so honestly, the class just kind of felt like a slog. I mean, I did it in one night, but it still was not the easiest class to get through, especially because of how dry it was and just how many different types of topics about global business that it tried to cover. My recommendation is that you just need to grind it out. I mean, it's not a super easy class. Um, I did find the cohorts to be very useful, especially um, for the first unit, which is where like 30% of the grade uh, comes into play. So that's it for D080. I wish you luck. It was probably my least favorite class so far. Um, say hi. Say hi. Anyway, this near dad extraordinaire is out of here. I wish you luck with D080. Uh, if you have any questions or if you need any help with any of the courses, uh, reach out to me. I'm always happy to help. Um, and that's all I got for you. Thanks.